So just a heads up, my videos tend to contain naughty words. Some of the games I play may contain gore and violence. Uh, any music contained in these games is not owned or created by me unless I express otherwise. And any political views expressed in these games does not represent my own views. You have been warned. So if you do choose to watch, please enjoy. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Spyro. Back once again, Spyro 3. This is part 12. This has actually gone on a lot longer than I thought we would. Saying that, I have been doing terribly in quite a few parts of the game. Namely, Speedways. Uh, well, the Hunter Challenge is in there, and Enchanted, no it's not Enchanted Towers, it's a level in the first game, that place, the one where I basically just died repeatedly, <coughs> pardon me, alright, so, I did Agent Nine's World, uh, yeah, I've done Crystal Island, uh, did the... Tomb Raider, but not Tomb Raider one. Uh, so what have we got left? Ooh! I forgot about that. Mainly because in the original days, literally just a rock breakthrough. Get that tail. Get it! Yeah, but that's all the eggage. Wow. Thanks, game. Did that not just work, or did I just miss it? The second one is quite possible. Nope, it just didn't grab me. And I'm pretty sure I didn't lose a life, because I'm in a homeworld. Oh yeah, this is a thing these guys do. They just scream at you. <laughs> Take that. Haunted Tomb! It's actually quite a cool level. It's hard, but it's got a cool theme. It's like a uh, pharaoh themed. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, I've done the previous Sparks levels as well, haven't I? Yeah. So what I'm going to do is... That came out of the wall! Uh, anyway... Oh, never mind, I've done it. I was going to say, I'm going to get all the gems here. And then I did it. Uh, I'm going to do that level later, because it's a special level. Uh, yeah, there's a Sparks level, there was an egg down there. Oh, I've done the speedway, haven't I? Let's have a look, instead of just wandering around. Yeah, the speedway's done. Alright, sweet. Well, in that case then... Let's go to one of two of the final levels. Haunted Tomb! I do quite like this level, even though it is a bit of a pain in the ass. But it does have the uh, the death slide in it, which is both fun and can be difficult. And it's got a quite annoying tank section in it. Yet another daredevil adventurer has come to rob our catacombs of Oh yeah, they ask you riddles. Let's just hope you're made of tougher stuff than the last guy. If you can survive the trials of our catacombs and answer my riddle, we will give you a prize befitting your efforts. Here is my riddle. I am a vessel without hinges, lock, or lid. Yet, within my walls, a golden treasure is hid. Egg. What am I? Uh, pretty sure I got hit them with a rock, I believe. Nom. Run. Nom nom. Yeah, that's it. And these guys are like uh, Earthshakers, kind of, from um, Sparrow 2. Don't throw rocks at me, bro. 
Shit hurt. <laughs> I have no idea how that actually hit him. It just sort of bounced off the floor. E Weird pharaoh dogs. I don't know why I tried to flame them. I just, I, I just, I just don't know. Man, this music brings back memories. That wasn't properly English. And it looks like a fodder just got absolutely annihilated by these rocks. Oh, so did I. Me too. Me too. And again. And again. Let me just, just... Oh, I got a life. I did it. I finally did it. I got a life. I'm so proud of me. Uh... Yes. Why have I... Why have I only got blue... What? Why? I'm so confused. I've only got blue health here. I picked up a life. That's not right. I should have full health. Yeah. Screw your sarcophagus. I'll desecrate your remains. Oh, there's the, uh, the death side of doom. Death slide of doom and death. Anyway, let's go get crushed by rocks again. Yay! Just that's just embarrassing. Christ, man! I'm doing I'm doing so bad in games I've been playing recently. I just played uh, Battlefield 2042 earlier. I didn't record it because you know it's. What the fuck? And uh... I did... Terribly... I didn't even get hit. That did not hit me. Yeah, I think, I think I've just got... Bad at video games. Because Spyro games, games that I have played... Multiple times. Like... A lot... Of times. I have done real bad. And Jack and Daxter as well. I did terribly. Uh, oh, Jesus. Uh, I need another boom rock. Give a rock, please. Dog. Nah. I like to iron if they're men enemies. Nose is blocked again. Why am I so snotty these last few episodes? I think actually, if I go straight to the end, all the doors just stay open. You think? Alright, let's try and not get destroyed by these long range rocks. Sparks just took damage. Sparks got hit by that and took damage. I did not get hit. I mean, the second one I did. But I heard the taking damage sparks just flew into a rock. This is weird. <coughs> right, I've got to make a break for it. Oh, actually. Oh. Run. Can you... Screwed it. I don't know why, for some reason, I'm remembering rocks like just falling out of the uh, the Goo River. I kind of actually needed to keep him alive, really, didn't I? You see, Sparks have just gone up to full health when I picked that life up. I'm so confused. Good whining. Ta da! Right. Uh, actually. No, I don't think so. Run! Flee! Go, 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 go! Really? Fine. 
screw you, man. Yeah, now I'm definitely not gonna make it. Asshole. Don't whack me, dude. Don't hit me with your rhythm stick. Right. Now it him. Yes, give me ammo. Powski. <laughs> Fine, I'll come back and get it later. I've got to come back this way anyway. Ow. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Did, didn't fancy picking it up, Sparks? No? Or that one? Get it. Oh, I thought that was a gem. <laughs> oh, now he picks him up. What's going on with Sparks? Uh, but, but, please stop. <clears throat> I see you've managed to survive the trials of the catacombs. Yes. Now let's find out if your wits are as quick as your feet. Do you remember the riddle? Yes. I am a vessel without hinges, lock or lid. Yet within You're an egg, bro. a golden treasure is hid. What am I? Air to egg? He stabs him. An egg. Oh, one of them is a bandicoot. I never thought you'd get it. Very well, a bargain is a bargain. You may have the dragon egg that I was guarding from the sorceress. Good. Will. Will egg. I've waited a thousand years for someone to solve that riddle. Now I can finally head off the seashell shore to bury some bones. <laughs> um. Okay, bye then. <laughs> Just instant transmission there, apparently. <clears throat> The, the slidey slide of doom. Why do I seem to remember this being very difficult? I don't know why. Bother. I remember that being a lot longer and in a different area. Why do I remember there being a slide that was very difficult? I don't know. Oh, cross can actually, if you time it perfectly, you can just glide to the bottom, I'm dead again. That corner is such a bastard. Let's see if I can do it. Yeah, you can just skip the whole slide and just fly to the end of it. Or at least you could in the original. I don't think I've actually tried it in this version. Let's try it. No, never mind. I think they fixed it. Oh, that corner is so tight. What the fuck, man? That was me moving fully to the right. Also, that creaking was not my ass. That was my sofa. I promise. I did not do a fard and a shit. Get ready to spend the next, like, two hours watching me go down this slide. <sighs> Jesus. Screw you, Malcolm, for getting stuck in such an awkward spot. Dickbag. Alright. I think all the doors are open now, so... Ow. Fuck off. So now I need boom rocks. Uh up there. Wow that fodder just got annihilated. I know the feeling bro, it keeps happening to me. 
Yes. It's the only annoying bit about this level. I should have kept the uh, Earth Shaper guys alive. Oh, nearly. This wouldn't be so bad if there was like a super flame power up at the end of the level. Give the rock. See that? That didn't hit me. Neither did that one. Wow, broken hit, but <sighs> he dropped it. He spat the rock out. Just as well. I don't know what he's doing, putting the rock in his mouth anyway. Uh, uh, what the fuck, man? Did you? What? Uh, oh man, this this game is broken. It was never this broken before. Sparks genuinely flew into the rock and took damage. And then I walked into the rock and took damage. And I also seem to remember that in the original, the explosive rocks would fall from the ceiling in here as well. Not just one spot in the whole level. Hmm. And the fact I didn't actually catch any of this when I first played through this game. Ooh, another life. I'll take that. Yeah, just that just goes to show how much attention I was paying when I first played through it. And then he takes damage, and he looks like he's not holding the rock anymore. This level's broken. I don't like it. Let's just get one of them. Ooh, and another one. Run! Har har. Uh, was there another one? Whoa! Yeah, walked right into that. And that one, apparently. Uh, yeah, I think that's all of them. Oh, well, I've got all the gems anyway. Sweet! <coughs> uh, oh, it's the tank bit. It's a Lovecraft. There is room for one more contestant, but you'll have to answer a riddle to qualify. Of course. The riddle is this. If one dragon can lay one egg in 12 years, how long would it take for 100 dragons to lay 100 eggs? Man, don't make me do maths. I mean, it would technically still be 12 years. <laughs> that is correct. Good luck in the demolition hovercraft competition. Thank God for that. That would have been embarrassing. Straight shot, lob shot, does that right, right. This can be a bastard. Uh. Ha ha ha. Hey. Yeah, this is actually stupidly difficult in the original because they don't miss, basically. And they can just lob shot you with 100% accuracy. Please accept this prize for winning the first round. Alright, MJ. Um, kind of disappointed he didn't do the, uh, the moonwalk the other ones did. Championship round. However. This is an exceedingly dangerous sport. Might I suggest you quit while you're still in one piece? Shut up, Doug. My, my, such a brave reptile you are. But you'll need much more than bravery to win the championship. Yes, I'll need a tank. Such a strange shaped hovercraft slash tank thing. Luckily, I can actually take my full amount of health in damage, whereas these guys just take one shot, which is awesome. So slow. So slow. Gaddy. Wow, I went all the way over there. Can I shoot that far? 
Yep. Thought he just sniped him. Oh, and then he just sniped me. El douche. Lol. Oh, I thought I'd go in then. It's weird that they're to lob shot me like they usually do. Oh, no, never mind. to win the competition in over a thousand years. I proudly present you this year's grand prize. Smashing. MJ and TJ. I feel like there's a reference there I'm not getting. Thanks, Doc. Sorry. I was about to say I didn't mean to do that, but I did not do it on purpose. But I like dogs, so now I feel bad. Cats, however, are assholes. Yes, you said this last time. One of those dogs with a funny hat put a curse on me just because I shot him in the butt a couple times. <laughs> he said he turned my tail into a snake. Does it look like a snake to you? It does feel kind of funny, come to think of it. Oh boy, that dog's gonna bang. Get him. Oh god, yeah. Behind this door lie the five deadly trials of King Rover. No one has ever survived all five. In fact, it is so dangerous that I cannot let you through this first door unless you are able to solve my riddle. A riddle. Here's the riddle. I follow you wherever you go. But the more of me you take, the more you leave behind. Footsteps. My, my, you're quite clever for someone with so little fashion sense. <laughs> You may proceed to the first trial. I grant your pardon. Kill them. Kill the snakes. It's weird that this is the only part of the game where you see these enemies. They've gone through all this effort to model and animate these enemies, and this is the only place you see them. They're not even in the main level. Destroying the spawning jars of the snakes. Oh, I was just got two of them on a rebound there. Lippy. I had a lot of difficulty with this when I was a kid. I'm pretty sure you couldn't actually jump either in the original version of this. Daddy. Screw you and your stick. Next. Yeah, this is a bit of a busy screen. Kill this snake. Snake? 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 Oh, I'm pretty sure I'm full health now. Oh no, it's not the last one. Alright then. the jaw Gimme It's kinda weird that Agent 9 can just shoot the uh the sarcophagi. You can just shoot them and blow them up. Ow. Asshole. Whereas, you know, Spyro needs to spit a rock at it instead of just breathing fire on it. What? <sighs> Fine, a bit from it. Oh, you gotta hold it down. There to be one. Ooh, life. Nom. And full health, and an egg. <clears throat> Rocks here. I thought she was picking her nose then. Digging for gold. Yeah. Uh, 100% level complete. Ta da! Oh, that's one of them. 
It's actually a really short level now that I think about it. 6,100 gems. Lovely. One of the best levels is on its way now. Except for some of the challenges in it, they suck. <sighs> Who are you screaming at? Stupid lizard. Dino ruins. Ruins? Dino mines. Dino mine! Entering Dino Mines. Yeah, boy. <gasps> Let's pretend that never happened. This took me hours to find this little secret when I was a kid. Genuinely hours spent wandering around this level. Fuck my life. I don't remember it being that difficult either. Although I'm actually, I'm pretty sure you're actually supposed to do that round from the other side, but... Oh, well. Oh, no, wait, no, you're not. Dang. Where did that gem come from? Did that come from the cactus? Yep. Oh. Some of the best enemies in the game. Oh, they actually have guns. I thought they took guns out. Oh yeah, I also remember these being absolute bastards as well, these enemies. Ow. And they shoot twice in the original. Oh, hello. Dope song. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Gotta break this dude out. Gosh darn it. Check on my prisoner only to find out he somehow <coughs> got away again. Then when I came in to look around for clues, one of them routed dinosaurs went and locked me in. Now they're out there causing all sorts of trouble and there's not a thing I can do about it. You can clearly just squeeze through these bars. And I mean, if you want to look for clues, there I've looked. Just just look through the bars. Just look through the bars. No wonder the dragons left. All the creatures here are fucking stupid. I do love this level though. Just because, you know, dinosaurs. With guns. Dynamite. It's great. They're cowboy dinosaurs. What more could you want? I know it's the only time you see them. But I think you might actually see them again in... Sparrow 4 maybe? I can't remember. That is my least played Spyro game, Spyro 4, I believe. Four times? Yeah, they only shoot twice in the original. Even though this isn't the original, so I should probably stop making that comparison, but still. <clears throat> Whoa! I know my. Oh, I forgot about these guys. Completely forgot about those enemies. And why can I remember you being able to break the windows? Nope. That's later. Never mind, I'm just being silly. 
Ow. Asshole. That's what you should get, Spyro. Just get yourself a fucking Barrette 50 cow. Snipe these bitches from a distance. Then no one would fuck with the dragons. We've stolen their eggs, bitch. I think the fuck not. Right before they launch a WMD at your ass. Oh, I remember these guys, because these are assholes. And the floating TNT crates. Wow. I'm pretty sure they actually had, like, harpoons in the original version. I did a roamy. It's not very roamy in here, is it? <laughs> That, that might be cough. <coughs> <coughs> I regret everything. Whoa! Uh, where is he? There he is. Ah. How did I miss him so many times? Another breakable wall in here. I think. I'll find out later when I'm missing stuff. <laughs> uh oh. I just got quick drawed by a, a dinosaur that has really small hands. Well, small arms. Hey, fuck you! I used to have T-Rex arms, man. It, was, it made it so much more funny. Ha ha ha! Yay! Uh, yeah, go in here first. Does it make it easier to backtrack for a level if I need to? Well, I'll I think it must have been the runt of the litter, though. Just noticed the Sergeant Bird wanting poster on the wall. Bless you. Jumping Jehoshaphat. That's the cutest looking dinosaur I ever did see. It's also the least dinosaur looking dinosaur I ever did see too. That was a terrible impression. Uh, hmm, I'll do this one first. This is quite annoying. It's another water tunnel challenge. Sours threw an egg down this flooded mine shaft. <laughs> I get it back for you, but I ain't such a strong swimmer. Yeah, don't seem like it goes. <laughs> oh, here we go. I don't want to. This level fucking sucks. Well, this challenge anyway. I think you actually have to do this twice. Oh lord, it fuck. I think you do have to do this twice. Once to get one egg and then the second time while killing all the enemies. Remember the rocks. Remember the rocks. There they be. I didn't even see them. <clears throat> I hate this challenge so much. Granted, it is a little bit easier with the improved controls.
Uh, oh shit. Oh, I nearly went straight into it. Yeah, that was uh, really hard to spot. So it's no wonder that I didn't see it. Oh my god. Gotti. Please don't make me do it again. Please. Oh, yes. Smashing. Yay. <laughs> now it is just in here, I think. The sheriff promised me I could be a deputy, so I'm off to help clear out all the dinosaurs. Well, if you just calm down for a second and stop all that whooping and hollering, I could tell you what's going on. The Bailey gang are holed up in them buildings over there. You're gonna have to go in there and flush them out. Why can't you flush? Good luck to you. <laughs> Asshole. Yes, this it's just basically an on rail shooter. It's actually kind of fun. Oh, you do have health. Well, because of course you do. <clears throat> I can't get the gems until much later. Also, I just remembered where the last egg is. Oh, I missed. Quick draw. I need health. Oh, yeah, there's one for Sheila and Bentley as well. Wanted posters. Oh, yeah, of course, because the sorceress is in charge. I couldn't hit him, that guy walked in the way. Dickhead. <clears throat> Reigniting. If you just call Shut up. slow as well. Oh, he just walks so slowly. You, you can't even move like him. Oh, I can get a skill point while I'm here as well. If he shows up. Oh my god, walk faster. Please. Please. Shot them around the corner. Or shot one of them round the corner, rather. Apparently, there was two of them there. And every fucker got blocked by that blue bastard. There he is. Got him. Yes. And full health. Smashing. Hmm. <laughs> How big is this gang crossed? Uh oh. Uh oh. Get him, get him. Yes. I don't know why the Bailey gang was trying so hard to steal this egg. That's not like them at all. I reckon someone must have put them up to it. It wasn't me. Sharon. 
the cartwheel. Anyway, damage. Uh -oh. <sighs> Jinkies. There's some right sneaky gems in this bit. And a very sneaky egg as well. See, look. Oh, you can move that slow. Yeah. Don't know why you'd want to. Because it is well slow. Which is the bank, I believe. Oh, it's meant to be. <clears throat> Sergio. That's all the eggs. Lovely. The gems. Give me them all. For I am greedy. I seem to remember there being a life laying around here somewhere as well. Hmm. Now I'm not too sure. Well, that's all of the gems. No, no, never mind, it's not it. Right. Well, back we go. Actually, I could just do that. Alright, well I've got all the gems, all the eggs. We are done here. That means there's only one thing left to do. <clears throat> Midnight Moontain. First, I want help from the screaming lizards. That'll do nicely. Here we go. Boys and grills, it's time to kick the sorceress's ass. She's a fucker to hit with it because the cannons suck. Stay still, you fat wench. Oh, here. Yeah. Good. Give me the, the hover thing, please. Get the thing. Ow. <laughs> well, I can only hit her once. That sucks. Ow. 
Oh, sheepage. Eat the sheep. <clears throat> Come on. I knew you could eat it more than once. Should be quite annoying. Ugh. Oh, it does not handle well. Oh, fuck off. Sheep, please. That UFO handled like shit. I couldn't move back into the arena. So it was just going straight, it wasn't turning. Let's try this again, shall we? Once more with feeling. Okay, bye then. <laughs> Fucking tangled up in cables here. Whoa. Give me thing. that. Give me that one. And that's that. Now to wait for like 10 years to get a new one to hit her with. Cool. I burn your ass. Any time today, Agent 9. Thanks, bro. Q. Sweet. Is it just me or is he firing rockets instead of his usual laser beams? Please, please give Ufo. <laughs> She's not uh, attacking that often, really, is she? <laughs> oh, it handles so bad. This one doesn't have limited ammo. <laughs> Why is she trying to melee me when I'm flying? Stupid sorceress. Oh, it turns so slowly. Now it's not turning at all. Well, that was weird. Yes, she did. George? Look at the rabbits, George. She just needed her to put her thumbs up. Like one of her thumbs up, she falls in. Spyro, you just defeated a sorceress, rescued the dragon eggs, and restored freedom to the lost dragon worlds. What do you plan to do next, hmm? Perhaps a nice vacation in Dragon Shores, hmm? <laughs> You're a real comedian sometimes, Bentley. <laughs> Outrageous laughter. <laughs> you know, I still have to find the rest of the dragon eggs. 
Plus, Hunter seems to have disappeared again, so I should go make sure he's not in more trouble. You haven't seen him, have you? What? Me? Oh, uh, no, no. <laughs> if, uh, if I do happen to encounter him, however, I will most certainly inform you immediately. He's off being a dirty bugger. <laughs> It's doing weird things into species things portals to take you to the dragon worlds but somehow i ended up here uh, maybe my coordinate tables are out of date yeah by a thousand years that would explain okay, it's what's the face so, cheap. so now that you're done saving the world Elora, again, no are you going to visit me in avalar sure Laura, but i still have to find the rest of the eggs and well hunters disappeared again she wants that dragon day Oh, hey, I can help. I just honestly got this. Agent 9, isn't that a Rhinoc over in those bushes? A Rhinoc? Let me at him. You want a piece of me, Rhinoc boy? Eight laser punk? Come on now. No fair hiding. Hey, I'm sure Hunter is in good hands. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm sure he will turn up soon. Promise you'll come visit Avalar soon, okay? How many times have I told you not to taste that mousse? It was Billy's idea. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that true, Billy? <laughs> Hold that thought, Billy. Spyro, great to see ya. Hi, Sheila. I've been looking for Hunter all day. Have you seen him? <laughs> Sorry, Spyro. Hunter made me promise not to tell you where they went. They... <laughs> you didn't hear anything from me. Gross. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> nope. Just punts her into the lava. It's a sad sight, Sparks. Another noble warrior falls victim to the plague of love. <laughs> Just look away. Well, I guess we'll have to find the rest of the eggs by ourselves. Come on, Spyro. Take a little break. Let's watch the show. Sparks just third wheeling the just sitting there next to them awkwardly, just like Y'all got any butterflies? Toys for Bob. Don't make me watch this. <laughs> yes. I might watch the next one because I wanted to look at that concept art. The adventure continues. Yes, this part is a little bit long, but yeah, no point really finishing it after forty-five minutes to then do. One like ten minute episode after, so this is my favorite bit of the whole game. Where are ya? Yes. Hello, Hello fuck Barry nuts. Spyro. I won't be needing any more of your money. Now now, don't look so surprised. I found one of the dragon eggs. I'm going to sell it for a fortune back at Avalar. Uh, uh oh. Why are you looking at me like that? This I, is the uh, best bit in the whole game. I've got to be going now. Two lords. I said he was going to get his, didn't I? Oh, it's so satisfying. get every single gem back that you gave him and I'm pretty sure actually the last two games or is it just this game <laughs> uh, never gets old <laughs> I 
it goes on for ages. It's actually kind of hurting my eyes. Get him. Double drat. Drat, 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 drat. I never knew dragons were so fast. That's it. I give up. I'm retiring to Spooky Swap to become a haiku poet. Good. Ow. Mm. Can fly better than Spyro. And he's just been born. Sick him. See, he said he was going to Spooky Swamp when he's just gone to Crystal Islands instead. Spooky Swamp is like two home worlds ago, bro. Oh yeah. Just before you kicked the sorceress's big fat ugly butt, she built a factory to make robotic bugs. They're meant to fight sparks, but I don't think they're any match for him. Bugbot Factory bonus world, yes. Don't mind if I do. I have a spring digging in my ass cheek. Ow here. <clears throat> yeah, this is the final sparks level. This can be a difficult one. And it's also the only time you have these blue bugs, even though they were in the tutorial for sparks levels, like right at the start, this is the only time you get them. And that's such a pain in the ass. Really? You don't destroy him? That sucks, because it did in the tutorial. Get him! Fuck it, get Oh my god. Yeah, this is one of the reasons why this sucks. I just didn't do that to begin with. Robotic ladybug with scissors on their faces. So many enemies. Oop, that one nearly got me. Now let's just batter this nerd. I'm pretty sure you could just charge into them in the original one. I mean, you could in the tutorial anyway, you literally just ram into him and then that's it. Ha ha ha! Shieldage! Twofer. Uh, oh, I've got to unlock the button. Uh, oh no, never mind. He's cleared. Sweet. Get him. Yes. Oh, hello. Oh, why am I there? Shot once and then turned around. Why have you forsaken me, Sparks? I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> These are actually kind of fun levels, to be fair. Just a little bit of a pain in the ass. Is there another one? Yeah. Uh... Oh god, my heat is turned back on. It's so warm already. Round 
Man, I'm gonna miss the Spyro music when I'm not playing these anymore. Eat, eat, eat the thing. Thank you. Not that I actually needed to. Now I need it. Ah, shit. Uh oh. Oh my god. I need help. Please heal me. Huh. I've got all the gems already. Really? It sounds like this level is a lot shorter than I thought it was. And now it's a boss. I'm screwed. I have no health. <laughs> Like they're all just watching in like Colosseum. Where is it? There is. Oh god, no, there's two of them. I'm going to die. Might be alright actually. I'll just follow him. One. Oh, you sneaky bastard. Turn around. That's illegal. Oh, well, I have done it. Annabelle. Ta da! Level complete! Right, well, that's all of the Sparks levels. I'm actually kind of surprised they didn't do a spin-off game where that is the game and you just play a spark throughout the whole game. The adventure continues. Almost immediately. Please. Please. Oh, my knee. Remember, sparks can break open treasure chests, and using the guidebook, warp you to any level you want. Sparks can open treasure chests now. You, you told me nothing about that at all. Literally nothing. And I could already warp anyway. Uh, yeah. Guidebook, maybe? No, that ain't it. I seem to remember there being a way you could check Sparks' abilities. I don't know. Here we go. Super bonus round! Bianca didn't come and, um, talk to me, because I've already got everything. This is the most satisfying in the game. And this is also the final level of the game. 15,000 gems. I'm about to get more! Oh. Yeah, boy. about you when you went off to fight the sorceress but I always knew you'd beat her he wasn't that worried he didn't help out this place is where the sorceress kept all her treasure but after she was defeated a bunch of thieves came and stole it if you can catch the thieves you're more than welcome to keep the treasure oh by the way Trip. Hunter is around here somewhere he's been tinkering with one of his new toys and wants to show it off you should go see him Will do. After I smash up this smug bastard. <sighs> so many gems. I love it. 
Also, one of the best things about this level. Never mind. That's later. Oh, I nearly got him. You notice the space sheep are back. Oh, fuck. Duped me. He turned left, but then went right. Snake a bastard. Stop right there, criminal scum! I need to play those. I haven't played them in ages. <laughs> ah, it's just so many. Uh, 17. And each door corresponds to a different amount of treasure. So the more we have, the more you open. Oh no, the extra jet board races are here. Oh, that snow thing is rough. How have I just noticed that they're actually carrying treasure chests? And not gems or eggs. Uh, 18.5. I should actually have enough for a door after this. Get here, you thick. Yee. Fully just threw him to his death. Yes. 16. I need 17 for that one. Pew. Hi, Spyro. I nerd. See Bianca? She was really worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress. <laughs> it was pretty funny. She cool, but she was scared stiff until you came back safe. I just finished fixing up an old submarine. Why don't you try taking it for a spin? Wanna take my sub for okay. a spin? Sure. Great. Hop aboard. Oh. <laughs> I like how Hunter gets all these like vehicles and gadgets and stuff, yet he doesn't actually fit any of them. I think there's actually gems down here that I can get without getting in the sub. I think there is breakable chests though. I think. Doesn't look like there is, I haven't seen one. No. More gems. Ah, oh, this is one of the best secret levels ever. That and Dragon Shores, obviously, because you get fucking super flame for the rest of the game. I mean, you've already finished the game by then, so it doesn't really matter. But they changed it in this version so that you can actually play the whole game from start to finish with it. And it's wondrous. Uh, that's the way out. Just want to have a look. To see. Nope, there is no opening in there. Well, I've got all the sun. So there's that. This. I. I can hear a sub driving around. So, uh. Well, I guess that's all of them. What next? Oh no. This is the world's fastest turbo snowboard course. The local champions are the Sasquatch Six, a gang of yetis on souped up snow discs. I bet that you could outrace the lot of them. If you win, we'll get a huge pile of treasure. If you lose, I'll have to slick down the whole course with my tongue. I kind of just want to lose on purpose just to make so, him do that. Ready to race? Right on. Yeah, fine. This sucks. This is just like the most difficult race in the game. Uh, especially when you get stuck on the uh, the ground like that. 
<laughs> Bye. Oh, nearly didn't land that. And I definitely didn't land that. It also takes so long to actually fall off the map. And then it just sends you straight back to back. Like, to the back of the fucking race. <sighs> what? Oh, I picked that up. Uh, that dude's stuck. Sweet. Never had that before. Yes. Yeah, it's usually best to just do front flips and back flips, really. Because nine times out of ten, when you exit out the barrel roll, you just get flung sideways, which is a uh, no fun. Oh, he got unstuck. That's not fair. No, he didn't pick it up again. I had just threaded the fucking needle there. Yeah, I'm not gonna do this. Why didn't I take my own advice? I also didn't get any boost for that, and I'm stuck on the floor. Oh my god, what is happening? <sighs> right. Fucking let's try this again, shall we? So, right uh, Sparrow, please. There we go. Good start. Uh, never mind. I've just been robbed. <laughs> oh, okay, so close to falling off. Um. Okay. That dude just pushed me off my board. Like, I didn't wipe out, he genuinely just pushed me off. That was weird. Well, at least I have a rocket to hang on to. And, never mind. Um, the game thought that was a half, the quarter pipe track. Ramp, not track. Oh my fucking... What is happening in this game? I'm so confused. I've never, ever experienced this before. Granted, I did only play through this version once. And he didn't do a trick then. Um... Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? The camera jumped out. I turned around. I got stuck in the air. I'm stuck. I'm, I'm still stuck. What is happening? Dope. And it sent me back two positions. How fucking fun for me. Give me that. Or don't. Just just fuck me over at the end of the race. Yeah, you could do that. What an absolute cunt. 
I was winning the whole fucking race and then the game just told me to go fuck myself. I hate this race. Fuck off. I just got stuck again. Really, I did like four flips and I just got like a quarter of a tank of turbo. Are you having a laugh? <laughs> oh, I'm not even mad, that was just funny. I'm just going full speed to, yo, look at this dope turn. not fucking nail it like five seconds before the end of the race and please not thread the needle through that hole again uh, I just went through the floor okay I'm having a very odd experience right now Just, just stay on your board. Don't fuck it up. I win. Yes. First time. Like a bunch of no. lead pants wearing cross-eyed glacier trolls riding slabs of plywood with sandpaper on the bottom. Yeah, we want some shiny stuff too. Right, we. What the fuck do you mean, we? I will kneecap you if you touch my gems. Satisfying. Uh, is there any more gems here, Sparks? Yes, there is. Uh, uh what? Uh, what? Um. Okay then. Um. Sparks, help, please. <laughs> Want the gems? Just, just show me the gems, Sparks. Where are they? Uh, not seeing any, so I think I might have them all. Yes, it looks like I have them. No, don't make me do the race, please. There is more here. Oh, oh fuck me. <laughs> I'm having a right mare in this place. <clears throat> Reigniting. Come on. I just go this way apparently. Further? You want to 
I have, well, I came through here. I rode right through there and I got nothing. Down there, no. That way, apparently. Another way I went. I am the skateboard. In before it's fallen off the map or something. Nope, it's right up there, apparently. Smashing. Right, well, let's go this way. Alright, I think I'm done now. I think that's him telling me to, uh, Vamanos. Let me just do that, because fuck that place. So, next, I think we can do that. Uh, we have 18,000. So, this one. Sweet. I can't break that rock. Just FYI. <laughs> Yeah, boy! Uh, I'm pretty sure... Oh no, it's not infinite. I thought it was. One... Two... Yes, death to the space sheep. I couldn't see with all the numbers in the way. I couldn't see where I was going. I'm too rich, you see. I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> yes, quiet. Too much money. Blind. Where's this other dickhead? There he is. Whoa! Hello. I hear a fifi. -fee. Uh, that one. Two left. Lovely. Two space sheep. Uh, uh. Uh, okay then. Also, why are they making thief sounds if they're sheep? They're not egg thieves. <sighs> unless, because you don't actually see the egg thieves' faces, unless the egg thieves are sheep. Trying to get payback on the dragons. Oh my god. Did I just open a can of worms on this shit? Die. Or is that a thief? No, that was... No, never mind, it is actually an egg thief down there. Fair enough. Uh, I have lost... I have found the sheep. I have missed the sheep and I have lost... the sheep again. Why is this one so hard to hit? Here we go. It's like the first hunter challenge all over again. Where's this egg bastard? Oh, he's... on a plane, I think. Well, me got all the gems. Uh, never mind. Yeah, I just heard him again then. Eh? I don't know how she did it, Spyro, but the sorceress must have survived that last battle. She's been waiting here all this time, saving up her magic to destroy you. Your best chance she will to try. Is my flying saucer. I've cast some spells to give it extra firepower and unlimited flying time. But the rest is up to you. You've come this far, Spyro. I know you can beat her. Why, 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 why does sorceresses have, have flying sources? It, it doesn't make any sense. That water texture's nice, though. Even though it's not actually water, it's just like purple goo. Oh no! This is actually quite a fun little fight, to be fair. It's like a strange UFO dogfight. Whoa! It's quite reminiscent of the, uh... Like the... The final phase in Ripto's fight. Where he's flying around on his big metal bird. And you just have... Well, Superfly, really. Oh! 
quiere. Yeah. Boom. And now we get to watch her die horrifically. Yin yang. Twins. The end. Again. So apparently all these dragons reproduce asexually because there are no female dragons at all. You never meet a single one in any of the games. <laughs> Just blast him with flame. <laughs> Take that you little shit. See how you like it. Well. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that is the end of Spyro 3 and the end of the Reignited Trilogy. It's only taken me about four years. Three years, maybe? Three years, I think. I think this game came out three years ago. But now we can look at some um, concept art, where Spyro is apparently doing some like kung fu training shit. Man, I love these games. Perfect games. Perfection. So does the art change, or will we just got to look at this one the whole time? I'm oh, not there, guys. That Spyro apparently learned how to breathe fire and has burnt that dude's moustache off. I hate when that happens. When you breathe fire and burn your moustache off, you know, I'll do it all the time. <laughs> I don't think you ever actually see... No. Yeah, I think you do meet that dragon. You definitely meet that guy. And apparently Spyro can play guitar. But without opposable thumbs... I have a guitar. I have two guitars. And yeah, it's basically thumbs. How does he hold the pick? And, you know, how does he actually fret? Because if you just use your fingers without using your thumb, you can't put pressure on the necks and you can't push the frets properly and then it just sounds horrible. <sighs> what is going on in that picture? Spyro is wearing a helmet and has conquered that dude, apparently. Oh, oh they're like doing a play, like reenacting some Shakespeare or some shit. I wish I could draw like this. I can't draw to save my life. But this is just, just. Art is amazing. Yeah, we're just chilling in the credits at this point. Just looking at some art. Uh, feel free to check out at this point if you want. I don't blame you. I mean, it's a little bit boring. Uh, he has broken a thing. Uh, a plate? Yeah, it looks like a plate. And the old dude's like, uh -huh, You little shit, that was my grandma's plate. Oh, I'm going to kick your little ass, you purple bastard. I've never looked at these. So he's done a statue of Zeri, and he's done a statue of Spyro, but I can't actually see what the name says. I 
think it says Spirocles like Hercules. I think. That's what I can make out anyway. Oh, and he's also broken Zoe's arm off. <gasps> How is she do magic? Spyro apparently got bored of painting. <laughs> so these are like paintings basically of Spyro when he was really, really little. Just terrorizing his like 26 dads. <laughs> I think that's how many dragons there were. I know it's a weird number. Or painting. Apparently, Spyro rather enjoys painting. Oh, I can't stop. Even the art's colourful. It's great. I'm saying that I could just skip these, but I want to look at the art. But also. There might be quite a few credits in some of my upcoming videos. Oh look, he's reading a book on flight. He's learning to fly. When he should be studying other things. Yeah, I plan on playing Metal Gear Solid. Like, all of them. So... You can't skip, you can't, you physically cannot skip the credits in those games. And they go on for like 10 minutes each. So I guess he's in a cuckoo clock for some reason. Cuckoo clock that has some dude sitting on the top holding the clock with his hands. Is that one of the fools? Nah. Can't be. Richard Brab Cat <laughs> uh, I guess they're having a break. Yeah, Sparks is sitting on a little chair at the bottom with very tiny sunglasses on. Apparently Spyro has a mobile phone. So apparently mobile phones exist in this universe, because Bartholomew has one as well. And I guess they also have coffee shops, because that's a coffee shop cup right there. Uh, that's where Spyro became a stripper for a little while and was hired to hide in a birthday cake. A very special thanks to Insomniac Games. Yes indeed. Because without them we wouldn't have these games. Or Ratchet and Clank. Or Resistance. Yeah, by Stuart Copeland. Anyway, that's basically the end. So let's let's just skip that. So I'm breathing fire apparently. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Hopefully you've enjoyed so far. Uh, if you have, feel free to like, subscribe, all that jazz, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.